Hey everybody, I'm so excited to make this announcement. On Sunday, our church officially called a new worship arts pastor, Michael King, who has been around our church for a long, long time. So Michael, would you tell everybody when you first came to Calvary and how long you've been around Calvary? He, uh, we were trying to figure this out the other day. I was four years old when I came to Calvary. I've been here for 21 years, if you can believe it. Uh, and then I've been... You know, went to school for a couple of years, came back. I've been here on staff. This will be my fifth year here back. If you've been around Calvary, I don't need to introduce Michael to you. You've known him since he was a child, but you may not know how talented of a musician Michael is. So Michael, how many instruments do you play? You don't have to list them, but how many instruments do you play? Uh, a lot. I don't know if I'd, I'd have to count. I don't know. It, okay. It's a lot. It's a lot. Hey, I, I think if you've seen him on stage or if you've heard him as a musician, Michael is an incredibly gifted musician. God has given Michael a gift for worship and for music. So much so that I'm convinced, man, you could make a lot of money if you were doing this outside of the church. If you were doing this in the band or if you were making records, you could make a lot more money than what our church is paying you. So really the question that I want folks that are watching this video to hear is, Michael, why do this for the church? instead of doing it for a paycheck and making a lot of money with all of your talent? Sure. Well, I, I really enjoy music. I love music and I love working on music, but music isn't really what I'm passionate about. Um, my passion is to see God's people worship Him well and correctly and often and passionately. Um, and what that means to me is that we need to develop a real true sense of knowing what worship is uh, and that comes from Scripture and knowing what Scripture says about how we respond to God. Um, worship isn't just the singing on Sunday morning, but it's how we talk to other people. It's how we engage on, online. It's how we, uh, how we do our jobs. All of those things are worship, and all of those things are guided by convictions mm -hmm. that we find in Scripture. So what's important to me isn't so much that people sing well, but it's that people live in a worshipful way every day. Yeah. And I think that starts on Sunday morning and can a lot of times start with our singing. Yeah. So one of the things I want you to take away from this video is Michael's title is the worship arts pastor, but please don't hear that means he's the music pastor or he's the musician for our church. As you just heard from him, from his heart, worship is it happens on Sunday morning, but it's it's throughout the entire week. And one of Michael's responsibilities is to help God's people worship him all week long. Michael, I'm thrilled that God put you in our church a long time ago. I'm amazed at the man that God has grown you into, the musician that you are. But more than anything else, I'm really excited about the minister that you are and how you will lead God's people to worship God well. So we're excited that you're here, man. I'm excited to be here. And I'll see you later.